Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Chow Vinsung. Welcome to our Healthy Eyes, Healthy Life series. In this video, let's learn more about the pterygium. A pterygium is a benign, fleshy overgrowth of the conjunctiva. The conjunctiva is the outer surface layer of the white part of the eye. The pterygium grows over the cornea, which is the transparent structure at the front of the eye. Pterygia typically develop on the inner corner of the eye nearest the nose and can occur in one or both eyes. An early pterygium may not be very noticeable and is unlikely to affect your vision or cause discomfort. As the pterygium grows, it appears fleshy and triangular and may cause eye redness. It can distort the shape of the eye to cause astigmatism, which requires spectacles correction. It is usually painless but can cause eye discomfort and grittiness. If the pterygium continues to grow across the cornea, it may obstruct the vision. Pterygia are caused by exposure to excessive amounts of UV light, hence are more common in people who live near the equator or those who spend a lot of time outdoors. Dry, windy, dusty and sandy environments and increasing age are some of the risk factors for developing a pterygium. To reduce the risk of developing a pterygium, wear sunglasses with UV protection, especially those with a wraparound design. A wide-brimmed hat when going outdoors to protect the eyes from sunlight exposure. Suitable eye protection, such as goggles, when spending time in a dusty or dirty environment. If a pterygium does not cause any symptoms, it does not require treatment. Lubricating eye drops can be used to relieve the eye discomfort associated with a pterygium. When there is significant eye redness, a short-term cause of topical steroid eye drops can reduce the inflammation. Surgery is the only treatment to remove a pterygium. You may choose surgery if it is affecting your vision, it is causing constant eye irritation, or you are unhappy with the cosmetic appearance of the pterygium. During surgery, the pterygium is removed, leaving a bare, uncovered area. A piece of conjunctiva from the top part of your eye, under the eyelid, is used to cover this bare area and is held in place either with stitches or glue. This reduces the risk of the pterygium growing back. After removing the pterygium, this may leave behind a cornea scar. The surgery may reduce your astigmatism, but is unlikely to completely eliminate it. After pterygium surgery, it is common to have some eye discomfort and redness for a few weeks. Your doctor will prescribe you antibiotic and steroid eye drops. Pterygium surgery is generally a safe surgery with a high success rate. In 5 to 10 people out of every 100, the pterygium may grow back, especially if there is persistent exposure to high levels of UV light. Rare complications include infection and scarring to the eye muscles, causing double vision. Most patients who undergo pterygium surgery have a good outcome. I hope that you enjoyed this video about the pterygium. Please subscribe to our channel to learn more about other important eye conditions. Till then, I wish you healthy eyes and a healthy life.